The farmers have had it. They've taken to the streets across Europe, protesting cuts to tax breaks, competition from cheaper imports, onerous environmental regulations, and sprawling bureaucracy. The spark came from Germany, where the government rolled back agricultural diesel subsidies. If that sounds familiar, that's because in 2018, it was a seemingly innocuous fuel tax that unleashed the gilets jaunes across France. In Germany, a partial backtrack by the government wasn't enough, nor in France. Even the EU has had to flinch. What makes it even harder for politicians is the overwhelming support for farmers by the broader population. There's also an impression. An impression that lofty climate and trade goals are being issued by lawmakers far from the soil that grows the food that sustains them, and an impression which anti-establishment politicians hope to harvest in a year rich with elections.